It will soon be easier for you to repair your cell phones and other electronic devices that you own. Today, Governor Gavin Newsom signed the Right to Repair Act. CBS 8's Jasmine Ramirez explains what this means and how it ultimately affects your wallet. California's Right to Repair Act is a win-win for consumers and local repair shops like this one. It expands access to information, parts, and manuals that people couldn't get their hands on before. Obstacles that we have, all the roadblocks that are stopping us from doing this or doing that or materials that aren't there and we have to reverse engineer things and figure it out for ourselves. Tony Hubel described the challenges he faces as an iPhone and MacBook repair shop owner. So I cannot get my hands on this chip ever. So the only way that I can get it is I would have to purchase another one of these or acquire one of these and then uh, harvest or salvage it off of this so I could repurpose it. The Right to Repair Act is expected to change this. It requires repair manuals to become more readily available. This information will help keep devices working longer and can save people money. By giving people what they need to repair rather than replace devices, we can reduce all of the waste that is ending up in our landfills. Local college students rallied for the Right to Repair Act to become law. You know, it makes me believe like actually maybe we could do things, you know, today for a better future. Um, I think it's even goes beyond Apple itself too, like Tesla cars, maybe washing machines, drying machines, refrigerators, all other ele electronics. Um, it's going to help everybody. Other states, including New York and Minnesota, have similar laws. However, the new California law has tougher rules. It requires companies to expand access to parts, tools, and documentation for a longer period of time. Seven years for products priced at $100 or more. Three years for products between $50 and $99. And the Right to Repair Act is expected to go into effect in July of next year. Now it will apply to products made and sold after 2021. Marcella, Jesse. Good to know. Thanks so much.